Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Today we are doing a Nickelodeon TV show. Going to be doing some Ren and Stimpy, another uh, pretty much TV tie-in instead of the movies. We're going to see a few of those. Not as They're not as rampant for whatever reason as the movies were, but they were definitely uh, out there. We will see how well this works. This, Ren and Stimpy definitely lends itself to a video game. So with uh, that being said, I'm sure that they have a lot of, to work with. If they do it or not is a whole other story, but we will see how this works. I actually really enjoyed Ren and Stimpy. Ren looks awful. Or Stimpy looks off. Yeah, Ren looks awful, Stimpy. For a minute there I was trying to think of uh, who was what. Stimpy, you idiot. All right, so what are we gonna do here? Let's see, we get some socks. Let's see, we shoot spitballs. All right. Hey, it's Log. What well, rolls downstairs and numbers and pairs? What well, rolls over your neighbor's cat? What's good on your, uh, what well, fits on your back and great for a snack? It's Log, Log, Log. It's Log, Log. It's big, it's heavy, it's wood. It's Log, Log. It's better than bad, it's good. <laughs> All right, let's see, do we go in here? All right, we go in here and see what happens. All right, so we are in a very large, clunky ship that takes up a good quarter of the screen. It's it's fairly responsive, but the fact that it's so big does not lend itself well for uh, this kind of game. Because it's going to be a lot harder to, to bop and like stuff like this to kind of move out of the way and still be able to get into it. <laughs> it, it we're, we're fighting random shit too. We got rubber ducks, chicken dinners, baseballs, pool balls, jars of whatever, fish. Oh, we pick up the money. All right. We got planets. We got all kinds of random shit there. Toilets. We blew up the money that time. All right, so we we did it enough to get through here. Hey, we have a ray gun now. All right, cool. All right, so what now? We can't go that way. We already did that. We can't go through the door. What are we what are we missing? Are you missing something? I mean, all in all, it's a pretty basic game. Yeah, it's Ren and Stimpy. It does have the Ren and Stimpy vibe with the artwork and everything to a point. Uh, we ran out of our ray gun. Alright. But, I mean, all in all, nothing really to, to write home about. It, it's pretty much doing the characters, but it's, it's as basic as you can get at this point. Like, it's, it's kind of disappointingly basic. There's a lot more they could have done with Ren and Stimpy, I think. I mean, granted, limitations again. The hard part about doing stuff like this on paying attention to the old school games is... We know what everything is capable of now, but back in the day, they did have ex some some serious limitations on what they can do. I mean, a lot of places did push the limits and produce some amazing quality stuff, um, and some just kind of took the limitations as oh whatever and kind of just rolled with it, and I think kind of uh, slacked on things because they didn't want to try to find workarounds like some of the better companies did because there's a lot of stories about many many games that uh, had some serious crazy things that they did to work around the limitations in order to actually uh, you know give you a really good game and uh, everything ah we keep blowing up the money 
Yeah, I'm not a fan. Oops. For some reason, I'm so used to turkey being food and getting health that for some reason we, we just ran right into it hoping that we'd get healed, but we died. I mean, it feels like another kind of hodgepodge. I get what they're doing here. It does fit. Like, we get transported in here. It's a little, like, side game kind of thing. It's not as hodgepodge as some of the games we've played. And, I mean, I, I really do understand what they're doing. And it is, you know, it fits the Red and Stimpy having this giant, like, jalopy of a wind-up uh, spacecraft that we're flying in. But it doesn't change the fact that it is so clunky that it, uh kind of makes things a Wow, we got a lot of lives. Let's see, we got socks, that, that, what is this? Springs. We, we picked up a remote or whatever, but that doesn't seem to be part of, uh, or maybe that's the gun. Like, I, I don't understand what's going on. That we, we were kind of doing a whole lot of nothing at this point. Are we supposed to get Ren over here? Or, yeah. Like, we're doing this again. We're just, same thing, nothing changes. It's somewhat random. It feels like, so at least there's that. It's like this thing keeps going, like, just in the spot where we can't do anything with it. And we don't, we don't seem to be able to move on until we destroyed it. So that was interesting. I don't get what's going on here. Okay, so maybe so we use these to get Stimpy to do or Ren to do stuff. Guess we'll try it again. Maybe we gotta get him to the door, kind of a, a Lemmings or a Lost Vikings kind of thing. Okay, fair enough. So now we gotta do this again. Yay. Kinda, I'm definitely over this part of the game right now. And I would like to see what else is going on here. I haven't figured out yet if it if we're going by uh, just how much money we make doing this or uh, or by distance. And I feel like it's more the faster we get out of here, the more we collect money.
It feels like we're getting extra men constantly. Alright, so he's, he's in here again, so it feels like we gotta do this again. Uh, this is not fun, to be honest. Like, the 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 fear, the pure, just constant uh, regurgitation of the same thing. I mean, this level is only like ten feet long, and we keep doing this whole thing over and over and over again. We can't bypass it, and it, it just kind of makes the game very, very repetitive and boring. Um, I get what they're trying to do to a point. We're, we're, we're kind of lost Vikings it a little bit where we're using all these different things to get Ren to get over here, I guess, to get to the door. But um, I don't know. It's so lackluster. And, you know, again, we're the whole point of this level is we're going to keep doing that same thing over and over and over again. And we're actually out of the springs, too. So I don't know what we're doing after that. To the point where I just I don't really find it enjoyable and nor do I want to continue to do it like I really wish that you can just throw this over there but you can't so that's about as far as it gets now we're out of the springs anyways it's like it's just kind of I really kind of feel disappointed Oh, so when you run out there, they're happy enough to give you more so you can keep going. I don't know. I feel like they could have done so much and had more fun with the, the licensing for Ren and Stimpy than they did to the point where it's just kind of meh. Like just this. Being able to bypass this to a point would have been great. But every time you do something, having to keep doing it over and over and over again... We've already done it like four or five times, and I just don't want to do it anymore. It's just not pleasant. Uh, visually, it works well. Like, I do like the way the characters, especially uh, Stimpy. Stimpy, of course. I mean, Stimpy is Stimpy. You know, he's iconic. He's got that perfect look, the, tan the tongue hanging out. Um, controls do work. I mean, they're responsive. It works good. The music is fun. It's colorful. You know, it, it's well done for that. But the game itself is is far far lacking like this is such a small level i get it it is the intro level to have you figuring out how to do this and getting everything done and i guess we should do this again and see if we can't get him over there but it's just so boring i don't want to keep doing this like if they if they changed it up sure maybe not so bad but like it, it's no, there's no real change. It is somewhat random to a point. But, um, like I said, your ship is so clunky and big, which I know is part of, you know, on purpose, definitely. Like, it had to be. Like, there's no reason for it to not be on purpose for them to do it. But, um, it just also kind of takes a little out of it. Where you're like, you're just so big and, and everything that you're just like. Ah. Alright, so we'll do this again. We'll wait till he comes over here. And this whole thing where it's just like, now we get to sit here and wait. Just could, and build up the excitement to do the spaceship again. <laughs> ah, and then it ran out, so now we gotta wait again. <laughs> like I don't know, the everything about the game feels like they just kind of didn't care and just went with whatever. I mean, some effort was definitely put into it, but I don't think enough. I don't know if 
they put enough thought into it. Like, I don't think anyone tested it and was like, hey, this works well. Let's keep going with this. I think that they just kind of programmed it, did it. They had an idea or the lead design was like, this is what we want. And they just did it and didn't bother to test it to see how well it even performs. I mean, that's just kind of my feeling on the whole thing. Because honestly, the, the, the constant doing over and over and over again just doesn't feel feel well if welly does not feel well thought out it just feels like they did something and they're like cool that works let's just go with it and and that was it like this part right here is is so uh, aggravating Because you can't really keep going progressing until you get rid of all those. Like, those have to be done. And the pattern doesn't make sense. They go down here. They come out there. It's just like... I don't know. It's really annoying. Because it is a bit of difficult to control your ship to a point. That it, it makes catching these stupid little things a little annoying. At this point, I'll take the hit just to get the money. Ah. All right, so we got that. Yeah, we're at, uh, oh, two lives. We've got 11 money bags. Okay. So now that we're both here, so that is exactly what it is. <coughs> Excuse me. So, it's kind of a whole Lost Vikings kind of thing. We won $10,035,000. Wow. Alright, we're going to try this next level. See if they did any improvements. See if the level, uh, if anything really changed. Oh, okay, so we are going to be... <laughs> we're gonna, we get the bitch slap with... <laughs> okay, I, I do like that. Although he doesn't seem to do it. Wow, that took a lot of bitch slapping to hit the, to get that damn chicken to go away. All right. All right. So apparently, very weak. Like it's funny, but it loses its charm real quick. The simple fact that you can't really do any damage really completely kind of just takes any of the fun out of it. Like being able to bitch slap the, tur the chicken and then have it actually go away. <laughs> but we can't do anything. Oh, we get to change. Alright, so now we have... Bit wide, Stimpy. All right. So Stimpy stuff actually does something, which again is disappointing. <laughs> we got a shark. That no response. It just hits you. Like hey, the more I play, the more disappointing it, it the game becomes. Honestly. At least you guys heal when they change out. But again, I like if you pay attention to this uh the levels, I mean, everything is just so, like, uninspired. It's like, there, how basic can we be? And this is how basic. This is a basic bitch right here, is what this is.
There's a lot of like unavoidable things. Like the whole jumping where sometimes you jump and sometimes you just kind of turn into this jelly like thing and And we're back to the same thing. It's See shit like that just kind of stupid. It drops it right on top of you. You don't move fast enough to be able to actually avoid half the stuff. Yeah, the controls are responsive, but you're still slow. Yeah, it, it really loses its luster real quick. Like it just, it's not well done. It really isn't. They, they, took, the, they took a really good license that those two characters lend themselves so well to a video game and they just made it really bad. Like the levels are just uninspired and boring. They're repetitive. <clears throat> the, the way they have the characters doing everything is just doesn't work. The controls are responsive, but your guys are pretty slow, especially uh, Stimpy. Stimpy does not move very fast. Uh, Ren is kind of, they're both kind of meh to where they're doing a lot of stuff that you just, you can't avoid. Like they drop in the cactus guy like on top of you. The shark, I, I, you can tell where he's coming and you go to jump, but it doesn't jump. Your shark, you just get bit by the shark. Uh, stuff like that where it's just an annoyance and they're doing it on purpose, I feel. And it just, it's not well thought out. It's not well done. Um, and like I said, it really is just uninspired and basic. And that just, that just doesn't work. Like they had such a, a gem that they could have really had some fun with. And I feel like they squandered it. So that's going to be Ren and Stimpy. That's going to be me. You guys have a great day and we'll see you next time.